India's External Affairs Minister S. Jay Shankar has arrived in Moscow, kicking off a five-day long visit to Russia. He'll be holding talks with his Russian counterpart Sergei Lavrov and also Russia's Deputy Prime Minister. The discussions will cover various aspects of bilateral relations, including trade, energy, defense and connectivity. The Jashankar's visit is in fact a part of an ongoing high-level exchange between Russia and India. It will also include engagements in Moscow and St. Petersburg, and Jashankar will also be meeting with the Russian Minister of Industry and Trade. The talks will span bilateral, multilateral and international issues. Economic cooperation, people-to-people -people engagement and cultural ties will be in focus. And this marks the second time when the annual India-Russia Leaders Summit will not take place. And this is the highest institutional dialogue mechanism between the two sides. Over 21 such summits have in fact been held so far between India and Russia. And it was last held in the year 2021, the year that both the countries elevated their bilateral cooperation with the beginning of the 2 plus 2 dialogue. The last time Jayashankar in fact visited Russia was in November 2022. Ties between India and Russia have been growing closer and are marked by the spirit of special and privileged strategic partnership. New Delhi and Moscow are both members of major international groupings including BRICS, G20 and Shanghai Cooperation Organization. And our principal diplomatic correspondent Sidhan Sibyl sent us this report from New Delhi. Listen in. The Indian External Affairs Minister Dr. S. Jay Shankar has started his Russia visit. This is a five-day visit in which he will be in Moscow and then to St. Petersburg. He will be holding talks with his counterpart, the Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov and the Russian Trade Minister Denis Montrov. Essentially, there are several pillars to this relationship, whether it's defense, whether it's people-to-people -people relationship with many Indians traveling to Russia for medical education or increasingly energy with India increasing its energy intake from Russia, especially in past two years. But that has led to a certain problem of trade deficit. But essentially, both countries um, have a strong relationship. Both are members of groupings like the SCO, BRICS and the G20. Russia will be the chair of the BRICS grouping from next year. And that means more consultations. Earlier this year, we saw the Russian Defense Minister and Foreign Minister traveling to India amidst the presidency of India when it comes to G20 and SCO. The visit of India's External Affairs Minister will only reaffirm the strong relationship between the two countries. With video journalist Ajit Sudhan Sibal for Vion in New Delhi. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.